Let's take Combat Ultra Stim. Because that's what you do in these situations. We could take Hydra too, but we'll probably get addicted. But, you know, whatever. We'll take Saul the Tall. I mean, it's... Oh, we didn't get it. addicted. I think they're dead. I th <laughs> you think they're dead? I think they're dead too. ourselves in the process though now we're encumbered beautiful okay so we took care of those two guys let's just uh, see if there's anything to loot in here it's a tripwire that got set off somehow. Oh, here. Here we go. Activate your survival. That's what that was. Okay. We have one more grenade left, and then we won't be able to use this anymore. just really concerned at the moment about running into traps since I'm really really good at running into traps okay this is a new room that's a chem station of some sort microfusion cell that Okay, it looks like that's all we can do here. Turpentine. Some of that stuff is so hard to see. Okay, let's go in here. We got... That was just... There's no way I had enough time for that. Okay. Let's get splints on our arms. And... Can we... We can't do our torso. Okay, I'm going to do an antiseptic and a bandage and a normal stim and a blood pack. We can't open an easy safe. And we can't do an easy terminal. We can only do very easy stuff. Oh, that was unfortunate. But it is what it is. Once we get night vision then, you know, that'll improve things for us a bit in terms of being able to see better. Okay, there's a mine right there. Here we go. <laughs> Got it. Got another splint. That's good. Oh, Journal of Medicine. That's I think that's a permanent skill book. Permanent Medicine 1. We'll take it. Okay. 
Nice. Okay, we already can't went through there. I had to actually excuse me, go AFK for a minute. So okay, so we cover everything on this top floor. Right, that's the room that they were in. I don't think we need to stay hidden at the moment. Did we go back here? Oh, it's the same room. It's just a different door. Gotcha. Okay. We went in there and we've been in here. So this is a new area here. So watch out for landmines. Let's go down this hall. It's just a skeleton. Take that stuff. Glad they're providing five, five, six rounds. Great. Okay, that's good. That's all good stuff. Got it. <laughs> We're replenishing our frag mines. You just gotta be fast. Well, you gotta see him first. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go this way. That goes to the ground floor. All right, I hear a dude walking around. There's a landmine right there. Okay. Sounds like a rad roach or something. We got some terminals in here. You know what else I should be doing now that I think about it? If, as long as I remember to change it back out. Let's put this on because this gives us 10 sneak. That part about as long as I remember, yeah, that's a, a big ask for me, isn't it? Nine eleven terminal. Let's put a frag mine right at this junction. electronics. We need those to make weapon repair kits when we get high enough up to be able to do that. Sound station alarm. Oh. 9-11 call log. Most recent. 
911 dispatcher. 911, do you have an emergency? Woman, please help me. I think there's someone outside. I heard a noise and it looks like someone is out there. Dispatcher, remain calm. I'm sending a squad car over. May I please have your name and address for confirmation? Woman, sound of glass breaking. I think he's in the house now. Please send help. Oh my God, I think I hear him. Ma'am, I've dispatched a squad car. It should arrive within minutes. Try, interrupted, sounds of a scuffle. Man, sorry for the scare. My wife just muffled scream. Forgot to take her pills this morning. Everything is okay. Long pause. No need for that squad car either. Have a nice day. Hangs up. Call terminated. That sounds a little suspicious. I don't think I want to do that yet. Maybe later. If we need to create a distraction. There's a rad roach there. I hear the footsteps coming. Oh shit, he's right over there. Okay, hold on. Um, put this on. And grab... This... Where is it? Grenade rifle. Okay, he's almost down. Okay. All right, took care of him. Uh, let's stay sneaked, sneaky sneak, just in case. Uh, what is this? Nine eleven call. Your call is being recorded. What's your emergency? A man screaming, "Fire! There's a fire! My house is on fire!" Nine eleven dispatcher, sir, please try and stay calm. I'm going to connect you to the fire department. Please hurry, please hurry. Transferring. Germantown Fire Department, please state your emergency. My house is burning to the ground. Please send help. Just to confirm, your address is 1664 Clem Avenue. Yes, hurry. Dispatcher, all right, sir. The trucks have been sent. Is there anyone still in the house? Thank you. No, everyone is safe on the lawn. I think I hear them now. Thank you. Goodbye. Dispatcher, just try to remain a safe distance away from the house until they get there. Okay. Let's see what this one says. What's the nature of your emergency? The wings on my shoes shrunk and now the moths won't, uh, won't eat my kidneys. What? I shake my state capital. It only yields three fairy napkins. But how... <laughs> Could you please repeat that, sir? My banana slippers are like water boats because when the moon winks, sometimes it burns my hamster punches. Interrupted. All right, sir. Just remain where you are. I'm sending help. Man, continuing. And that's how you get to llama school. Y yeah, right. Okay. <laughs> Lama school? Okay. There's the switchboard. So I think we've cleared this room in this area. Well, no, that room anyway. You know what? Hold on a sec. I've got to turn my camera light off because I just can't. Uh, there's too much glare on the screen for me to see. All right. Take those. You know, it, it's kind of cheesy McSqueezy for me to, I, I, it's it's not realistic for me to be able to like change my armor <laughs> right in the middle of combat. So, yeah, I don't think I'm going to do that. I mean, the helmet maybe, but not the, not, not the armor. So we're just going to leave the combat armor on. I would maybe use that other stuff if I was going to do some extensive sneaking, but... Lying congressional style. That's probably a speech magazine. Permanent speech. Nice. Okay, I hear more footsteps. I think that clears this room. Well, uh, no, yeah, we don't need a ruined book.
This is where we came downstairs, right? Yeah, okay. There's rat roaches down that way. Alright, what is... You know, we're... It's, it just occurred to me, we're out of grenades, aren't we? We are. I don't know if <laughs> I don't know if we could use missiles indoors. Yeah, that might be a bit of a problem, huh? Okay, well, I think we're gonna have to that assault rifle is in pretty decent shape. We're gonna have to rely mostly, I guess, on our on our explosives. We have four frag mines. And I can just use five five sixes, because I just don't have any you know any armor piercing rounds. Maybe what we could do is use this. Those are now yeah, we don't want hollow points, not for super mutants. We just have normal ten millimeter rounds. Okay, let's go this way. goes down to the basement. This is a closet. I'll take frag grenades, you betcha. Nice. What else is in here? A paint gun? Guess that's mostly it. Okay. That goes down to another level. Let's finish this level out first, though. That's the guy that we killed. There's the rad roach. I hear more rad roaches. But I also thought I heard another... Super mutant padding around. Oh, yeah, he's right there. Shit. Alright, here, let's, um. Let's put that there. Oh shit, I hope that red roach doesn't make my frag mine go out. Let's grab a, uh, a frag. Gonna blow! Okay. I think that did the trick. Yep, he did. Oh, there we go. Jailer's key. Some 308 rounds and a marine assault rifle. Hmm. I wonder how that compares to our marine carbine. It's got a hunt. Oh, it's got a scope. DPS is 198. Ooh, nice improvement. It uses uh, okay, so it uses 308s though, so it's bigger. It's bigger weapon. Um, let's take a look at it. Okay, if we hold our breath. Okay. Yeah, this is this is actually a nice weapon. Um, I'm not. It's still going to be definitely a mid, 
a mid-range weapon, though. It's not going to be a close-up weapon, but then that's pretty obvious. The thing is, though, is we, we don't have a bunch of 308s right now, so we're still going to use the carbine as our main mid-range to close weapon. We know shotguns are pretty much worthless on muties. At least shotguns with pellets. Voices. All right, before we go that way, I just want to make sure we're covering the whole place. Floor for traps or mines. There's a some jet. Okay. Let's go ahead and did we come through this hallway? That sounds like an enemy. I believe we came down this hallway, right? Right. And that's the stairs going down further. Okay, so let's let's keep moving this direction. You know what else too? I'm gonna Let's take a bandage, just to kind of top our health off here. I'm going to find you. That doesn't sound like a super mutant. Nothing yet. Are there also raiders in here? You can't hide from me forever. I'm confused. Where did you go? That's is this the doctor we Oh that's hmm. that's the doc. Oh, okay. Well. She's just talking kinda like a raider would talk is, is all. Hey! Where? Okay, she's the main reason we came here. Um sure there's no mines or, oh yeah we'll take 308s yes we will here uh oh wonder tales from many lands the fish prince what if you guys want to read this just pause the screen i'm just going to kind of go through it quickly
Okay, that was way too much. <laughs> way too much information. All right. Here's red. You're rescuing me? I'm rescuing Thanks. you. Thanks. I thought we were goners for sure. I think the others are dead. Or worse. I'm glad. Oh, we got karma. Nice. I'm glad you're alive. Escort Red safely back to Big Town. Uh, okay, I mean, I want to do that, but I'm, we're not done. We're not done looting this place. I guess we could come back to it later after we get, make sure she's safe, because that's why we're here. Me too. I'm extremely lucky you came along. Okay. Um, how did you? Uh, how did you end up here? So what's with the? Yeah, I mean, I kind of know how you ended up here, but let's ask her. Damn super mutants have been coming and carrying off our villagers. Never knew where they took them until now. You can reason with slavers and raiders if you have something they want. But muties are crazy. I don't know what they want with us. They probably want to eat you. Is there anyone else? Everyone else is dead. We're taken away to who knows where. Well, except maybe for Shorty. They dragged him off downstairs to the kitchen a while ago. Downstairs to the kitchen, okay. But no one comes back from the kitchen. Ooh, that doesn't sound good for Shorty. <clears throat> oh, I can tell her to wait here. Let's go come with me. We shouldn't risk our lives for someone who's probably... Already... No? Here, I want you to wait here. I'm not waiting around for some super mutant to lock me up again. You're not? Okay. There's a back door somewhere around here. If you're not back soon, I'm leaving without you. If I'm not here when you come back, meet me at Big Town. Yeah, I like that idea. Oh, oh. Okay. I would actually kind of prefer if you would leave and make your way back to Big Town, because everything to this point is clear anyway, and then I don't have to worry about you getting killed. And then I can come see you later and you can heal me. Uh, actually, can you heal me right now? I'll feel better once we're safe. Yeah, I, I don't want her to follow me, because followers... Followers are usually too dumb in this game. <laughs> um, and they give away your position, they get themselves killed, etc., etc. Just wait here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goodness gracious. Wait here, I'll be right back. I'm not or go home. Going home is fine too. Just don't die. Get back to your to Big Town so I can complete the quest and use you for healing in the future. Okay. And yes, you're welcome. Okay. I really wish they wouldn't screw up my field of view. Okay, we don't need to lock that or unlock it, as the case may be. Okay, we got to see if Shorty happened to have survived. There's nothing in these rooms except for beds. This is the big holding cell here. Stay safe. Here's a book you can read if you want to. It'll take you 10 years to read it, but if you want, it's there. Okay, let's go in here. Um, what is this? Police station terminal. Oh, it's locked. No, we can't do anything there. That stuff so we can make our encumbered self even more encumbered because that's what we do Ooh, yeah I'll take those can't get in that door my sword uh, actually helps work as a light I don't think we did we come through here I must have popped in here to kill that rad roach because it's dead Oh, right. This is the... Okay, I know where we're at. So confusing. So I think we're ready to go downstairs. Where does this go? Oh, that's just the main door. Okay. So we just unlocked it from the inside. I 
wish changing cells didn't turn your pit boy light off. <sighs> okay, here we go. Time to be sneaky sneak again. Oh, that's a that's a whole nother cell, okay. supposed to go. Oh, Shorty's over there. Alright, let's let's check check this room out first. I'm not hearing any enemies down here. That doesn't mean they're not here though. We can't get into that door. This is the shooting range. Why does it not surprise me that they're using dead bodies as their targets? You can get a lot of good stuff out of these mutilation bags or whatever the fuck you call them. They're disgusting, but we'll wash our hands when we get home. Fort Detrick Keycard. That's not... Is that that... Hold on a second. Is that that fort we... Found... No. Yeah, Fort Detrick. Oh, nice. Okay. Another place for us to explore later. Hey, look at this. Nice. Okay. Doesn't appear to be any muties in this first room. So let's deal with this rad roach. Hear more. Oh, they're all, like kind of all over in here. We're certainly pulling a lot of frag grenades out of here, which is amazing. Any, yeah, we have some frag mines left. Little man. Who are you calling a little? Shut up now! Oh god. Kill me. Okay. Let's grab a uh, uh no not a flashbang of frag Quickly, grenade. I beg you. <laughs> Wait, does he not see us? Hey! Stay away from him! Oh, ow! You gonna, you gonna go across our mines? Oh, did did he die? I think, I think he killed him. We weren't fast enough. No blood to spill today. Dude, what the hell? I'm right here. Oh, did we, did we kill him? 
I think so. The kill cam's kind of weird on here. Germantown Jailer's Key. Is he still alive? He is! Thanks God! Who are you? I'm here Never to rescue. Mind. I don't care right now. Let's go get red and get out of here. I was afraid he had killed him. Red's fine. Let's go. Hold on, short stuff. Who are you and what are you doing here? What makes you think I'm here to rescue? Okay, I'll help. Um, I Well, he was kidnapped. That's why he's here. Let's just... Uh, yeah, let's just go. Let's, uh, Red's fine. All right. If you say so, boss. But if we get to Big Town and she isn't there, I'll kill you. <laughs> That's gratitude. All right. You know what? Uh, I guess you. Right can, I guess you can oh, follow come me. Come on. Pay more attention to what you're doing. Dude, don't make me regret rescuing you. Look at all this food. We take all of that stuff. Can I get you to carry things? What's the hold up? You're kind of an asshole. Uh, no, I'm not giving you a weapon. You might shoot me in the back. Yeah, actually. If you're not back soon. That's fine. Just shut up and stay here while I finish looting. Um, let's cook. Fire roasted corn. Ooh. Okay, more rat steak. There we go. So we just turned all of our stuff into more valuable stuff. Yeah, you're not... You need to be a little more grateful, dude. I just saved your ass. Seriously. I must have a head injury. Obviously. Um... Oh, <laughs> we have an, we have injuries everywhere. Okay, let's go to aid, and we'll put splints on our uh, our a splint on our arm. That takes care of that. Let's take a blood pack and a bunch of expired stim packs, I guess, and some antiseptic to help that along. We're gonna have to deal with the head injury for now, I suppose, but. We can at least um, be healthy otherwise ish. Are there any traps in here? A bra uh, yeah, we'll take a Braxo cleaner. Guess we can take rad roach meat. I think that's it. All right. What's the hold up? Let's go. Right. Just keep your mouth shut. Don't step on any landmines. Ooh, a stealth boy, nice. I actually have three of those now. Yep, she's still there. I hate it here. Okay, I know you do. Let's get out of here. I'll feel better once we're safe. I will too. Follow me. Well, all right. Now, hopefully, I don't have to escort you guys all the way back to Big Town. If I do, don't be stupid, okay? Don't do anything dumb. Here we go. It looks like I do. Okay, what time is it? It is 2.55 p.m. So, as long as we don't run into anything too bad, we should be able to get you home on time. Also, I want to go back to this. I don't like that. I don't like that sort of thing, because it could cause crashes, or it could fling motorcycles at you when you least expect it and kill you. I know. It's happened to me before. 
nowhere to lie. You guys both coming? Hey, you don't have any doctor's bags with you, do you? I'll feel better once... All right, I guess... Oh. I guess I gotta get her back home first. We have that protectron over there that I would like to avoid. Okay, guys, so at this point, I'm just going to take these guys home. I'll keep the camera rolling in case something crazy happens, but otherwise I'll meet you all back in Big Town. Hey! Don't be attacking the dogs. Get out of the way so I can use my gun. Okay. You know, if you guys would just stay behind me and let me handle this, that would go well for all of us. Much better for all of us. Dumbasses. Let's just get you home. I've let, got one. Let me be the let Find me be the him. hero. No, hey. stay away from him. I've got your back. <sighs> Look out. Yeah. Teach you to mess with me. Look what we have. Hey. Where? Yeah. Don't mess with the super mutant. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Stim back. I'm hit. Yeah. We are I cannot. Oh, up. seriously? That. I don't know if this is scripted or if we're just running into them. If it's scripted, there's no way in hell I'm going to get these guys back safely. Because they're just going to attack them. They have no sense of stealth or tactics or anything. They just go head first into the fray. Can I tell them to get home on their own <laughs> so it happens through the code? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I have an idea. How many caps do I have? Maybe we could take the mole hole. I mean, seriously, I, the, their AI is just too dumb. That's a problem. But if we can take the mole hole ride back to Big Town, that will solve that problem. Hundred and twenty four caps to get back to Big Town. Let's do it. Oh, there we go. Thank goodness. Okay. Speak to Red about your reward. Hey there. Are hey. You hurt? Did he rescue them? Our hero returns. I'm just waiting for them to chillax. What's Shorty doing? Get over here so you can insult me and be ungrateful. Okay. What? Don't I count for something? They <laughs> rescued me at least. <laughs> All right, let's the finish this up. From Germantown. How's life treating you? <sighs> glad to be safely back home. I bet you are. I'm glad you're safe and sound. And please, I don't want any kind of reward. Are you planning to give me a reward for rescue? Well, I mean, that's not precisely true. I would like a reward, but. <sighs> I, I, I'm going to go with this one, though, because this one's kind of... It's kind of rude. Thank you. You're a real hero, you know that? I was going to offer you a reward, but I can put the caps to use buying medicine and supplies. You know, that's actually not a bad idea, because that'll help us in the long run, because then we can use her as a doctor. So I, I'm okay with that. I'm good with it. It was my pleasure. And we got Karma, Thanks. too. I know you've already risked your life once already, but I heard the mutants talking about another attack. They'll probably be here soon. Really? Um, I'll stick around to kill those super mutants. They should leave you alone after that. Um. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess. Really? Th that's great. I'll let everyone know. You're a real hero, you know that? 
Oh shucks. <laughs> uh, okay, so does that mean we're gonna get an, an attack here in a second? Our hero returns. Kimba, have you been here all along? Thanks for helping us. I just hope we can survive another attack. There aren't many of us left to run stores or anything. Oh yeah, can Red so stitch me up and maybe buy a few things? Do we know you? Yeah, we know you. You wanted I to. Told you he could do it. You wanted you to uh, go out on a date with me, and you it's like, no thanks. Okay. Whoa, looks like you've seen some act. Okay, good. So let's see. Um, you're a doctor, right? You're not kidding. You're in bad shape, friend. I'd be happy to fix you up for 150 what? caps. <laughs> Can't I get a freebie? <laughs> Shit. Okay, I don't have 150 caps. Um. Okay. How about if we sure. see if we can sell yeah. you some stuff, though? Okay. I'm going to sell you all of these drugs. Except for the jet, because we get bad karma for some weird reason. You can have the antnog. All of the meat and all of the food that's spoiled. All of the red roach meat. We're keeping the fire roasted corn. Wasteland hot dog. Let's sell the energy weapons magazine since I'm not likely to use those. Let's sell any junk that we have. Oh, shit. She doesn't have enough caps. <gasps> well, okay. Hold on, though. We, we can buy stuff from her, though, too, right? So... She's... Oh, okay. Uh, I can't... I don't think I can afford the doctor's bag. She's got a couple of waters. Okay, let's buy... A splint... Okay, let's accept. So that leaves her with 22 caps and me with... Well, even if I get all of those from her, I'm still not going to have enough for her to heal me up. That's a bummer. So that being the case, let's just go ahead and... Pleasure doing business with you. Did you know Flash used to date Butter Buttercup? I need medical supplies. Can heal my. How much are you going to charge me for a heal? Sure can. Nope. Sorry, can't do it. If that's the way. I mean, I could, but. So you. You're not hit. Shit, 150 caps. Okay. Um. Did you know Flash used to date Bitter Cup? <laughs> oh, that. I know all about that nonsense. Flash isn't the smartest cookie in the jar, but he deserved better than Bitter Cup. Oh, okay. She wouldn't be so bad if she just faced reality instead of doing that whole spooky girl routine. I don't even know what that means. Okay. Um, what's the history of this place? Big town? Fairy tale, really. The lamplighters who turn 16 aren't allowed to stay in the caves, but they have to go somewhere. And to encourage people to leave, they invented Big Town, the great grown-up place that you got to go to when you became an adult. I think you can see how true those stories were. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Except for I'm curious about this lamplighter cave. I already know you're the doctor in town. Yep. As long as you've still got the ass to sit down on, I can fix you up. <laughs> I'm also in the market for medical supplies. All right. Good to know. Um, how are things in Big Town? Oh, just grand, can't you tell? People are always dying to visit here and bring back souvenirs. Okay, that's a little cynical. Used to pay off or trick the slavers into leaving us alone. Not that it stops them much. Those mutants are the real problem. Too big to shoot down and too single-minded to outwit. They just keep coming. All right. Um. Be careful. So am I? Am I what? supposed Don't to I count for something? stay? You me at least. Here, let's talk to this little asshole. Things are looking good here, bud. Hey, you're nice now. 
What do you think will happen to Big Tom? You've seen those super mutants and their appetite. There's no way Big Town will survive with them around. From the look of things, I'd say a super mutant sat down in a ditch one day and shat out this town. <laughs> okay. I dragged myself here from Lamplight. I didn't believe all the stories about Big Town, but I wasn't about to let everyone else go there without me. A few dozen attacks on the town later, and here I am. Almost an ingredient in a super mutant chili cook-off. Yeah, you almost were. Uh, all right. If those muties try to take me again, I'll give them something to worry about for a change. Okay, so are we, we told the doc that we'd wait around for the next attack. Um... What am I, okay, yeah, we are, oh boy, we're not in good shape, but I don't have enough money to have her fix us up, unfortunately. She sh I, I should have asked for a damn reward. That's what I should have done. I, I'm trying to be Mr. Nice Guy, and now I'm paying the price for it. Okay, so let's go to here. And... We'll just try and get a little bit of food and water going. Oh, that restores health. Okay, let's hang on to, to those for that purpose. This gives us food, water, and a little bit of rads. That I want to turn into steamed mire look if I can figure out how to make it. Because that's actually really good food. And we don't need any of that stuff right now. So we have a lot of frag grenades. The problem with using explosives is if when the muties do attack this town, everybody else is going to join in too. And they're going to get hurt, which isn't good. So it's going to be very difficult for us to use explosives. Um, if I can get a hold of them from far off, we can put this to work. So maybe that's what we'll try and do. And I'm going to put the Blastmaster helmet on, too, because it gives us 10 plus 10 explosives. All right, now, let's look at our quests. Are, am I supposed to stay here for a minute? No, I guess, I guess that's not technically a quest. I think I should be mayor of this town, Kimba. Shorty, okay, Kimba's got a weapon. The other kids would just pick you up Flash up. has a weapon. Did the guy that was guarding here when we originally came, he might have been killed by the first super mutant attack. I don't remember. So what I'm going to do is just wait here for a little bit and see if an attack comes. If it doesn't, then we, we got to get going because, you know, we can't stay here forever. Ooh, Programmer's Digest. What does that do? That's just a temporary science boost. Okay. We've checked all you guys for loot. Uh, oh, can we take this? Oh, we can. I think it's because we're like really in good with them now, so. Does that mean we can loot all of their stuff? Hmm. We. Oh! You know what we can do then? I mean, normally, recipe for meat cake. Normally, I wouldn't take all the stuff, but these guys owe me big time, and I am in need right now. So we're gonna we're gonna loot them. Maybe not every single thing, but. If I can sell enough more stuff to the doctor, then I can actually get her to fix fix me up. A 
Braxo. We already came in. Oh, uh, that's the door we came in. Okay, so yeah, this is where we want to go. Oh, shit, they're here. Uh, oh, go inside. Come out this way. Let's get out of here. All right, now, if, if I can get this off... Oh, it's not loaded. Uh, too close to use. Not good. We <laughs> Shit. Run! I can oh, not good. I, I can't launch this here. I'm gonna kill myself. Um... <sighs> if I would... <laughs> If I would have had my fucking missile launcher loaded, we could have gotten a shot off and maybe survived. <laughs> Come out of here. Okay. Load this. Hurry up. They're too fucking close. God damn it. Alright, can these guys go inside the building? Can I get this out long enough to load it? Okay. Oh, let's do something else too. Let's take combat ultra stim. Because that's what you do in these situations. We could take Hydra too, but we'll probably get addicted. But, you know, whatever. We'll take Solve at all. I mean, it's... Oh, we didn't get it. addicted. I think they're dead. I th <laughs> you think they're dead? I think they're dead too. Okay. That worked. <laughs> Jeez Louise. <coughs> and that's how you do it. <laughs> oh, no, there's more. There's more! Hold on, hold on, hold on! Um... How did they not notice that? Oh, and the game crashes. Oh, Jesus, come on! Nothing ever is easy. Alright, go back in the house. Load the... Oh, it's loaded. Okay. Run out here. Oh, okay. That guy's already dead. I don't know what that was, but I'll take it. Did somebody throw a grenade? I don't want a rebar club. Here we go. That didn't kill you? This one sucks. Why did I agree to stay here and do this? Oh, man. All right, run back out here. Okay, that hurt me, but... Let's go to here really quick, grab a splint, fix our arm. We already took a hydra, didn't we? Okay, let's do an antiseptic and a bandage to... Oh! I guess I hadn't taken the Ultra Stim yet. Okay, now let's take it. Oh, 
Too close. If I can uh, sprint way ahead of him and then turn around and do that. All right, I heard another one. Where is he? We did it. Did we get them all? And did I manage to do it without killing any of you? You mean we're still alive? Oh my god. Okay, that was intense. Okay. You know what? I'm going to loot the rebar clubs so we can just sell them to the doctor. Well, actually, I don't know if she's going to buy rebar clubs. Whew. Okay, that was... Yeah, that was really intense. But we managed to make it work. It wasn't pretty. We looted all of you. I mean, we don't want these guys coming back here and dragging the dock off again. Because we need her. Can I pick your butt fruit? It's not giving me the option to. Okay, is this the doctor's place? Yeah. Oh, man. Okay. <sighs> here, let's loot her hey, stuff you. and then sell it, sell it to her because... Uh, oh. Oh, okay. No, I guess we can't take everything. Let's take the whiskey, the anti venom, the brace, doctor's bag. Yes. Welcome to my clinic. If you're hurt, then you're in the right place. You have 22 long rifle rounds. Can we cook anything in here? Yeah, more fire rusted corn. We can cook cooked rad roach meat. All right. I don't think she's going to buy 10 cans. I mean, she might. I don't know. Journal of Medicine. Nice. Permanent Medicine Plus 2. Beautiful. We'll take that. Okay. Uh, oops. Oh, that's right. She had... She had this guy down here. Caravan Guard. We looted him a long time ago. <laughs> um. Alright, Doc. At least... We did it! You did it! Yep. You helped us defeat the mutants! I did. Oh, we'll all feel safer now. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Now, can you fix me up for free because I did all of that? Um, it doesn't look like she's going to, right? Okay, let's let's sell sure. her Here's stuff to her. Sure. what I can spare. <laughs> uh, okay. So, uh, no, we're not going to sell the jet. Oh, I forgot, though. She doesn't have enough caps. Yeah, she doesn't have enough caps. To get us to 150, because that's what she's charging me to fix me up. Damn it, Jim. Um. And I can't, I can't buy stuff back from her because then that reduces my caps, and it's just a vicious cycle. So, I guess, I guess we're gonna have to walk back to Megaton in bad shape. <laughs> um. Okay. Well, it is what it is. We we got the doctor's bag, so so we have that going for us. She's got a lot of stim packs. At 37 a pop. Um, yeah, we only have three. I think uh, I have to assume she's given us a pretty good price too, just because that seems pretty good. I, I, I remember like Moira or the doctor and Megaton selling those for like 40 something. So, let's buy three from you. Because we have a lot of stuff we can sell when we get back to Megaton. Uh, well, do we? I don't know. 
Let's just go. A pleasure doing business with you. You want? You're not kidding. Yeah, you want 150. Okay. I'd like to help, but the. All right, guys, we're going to wrap up this episode here. And hopefully you can fix Time Bomb up. I'm going to limp my way back to Megaton. Uh, well, actually home first. And I think I'm going to apply the doctor's bag to my head so at least things aren't getting all blurry. And let's apply the, or apply rather, un... Okay, I do have a splint, so we can put that on our left arm. At least that takes care of all of the crippled limbs. Do we have any diseases? Backpack, idea minor. No. We don't we don't have any diseases. Okay, okay, so that's good. So we don't need to take an immuno boost then. We are re pretty thirsty. But we could take care of that with the water fountain at, you know back in Megaton as well. Okay, so yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to head back to... Uh, no, I'm not going to steal any more of her stuff. Except for this holotape. Noted. No added. Wanted. Trustworthy surgeon. What is that all about? Hey, Doc. I'm only sharing this with you because you seem like someone we can trust. Have you heard about the synthetic men they make up north in the Commonwealth? Well, the rumors are true. They're called androids. They're men like us, just made out of different parts. I know one of these androids. He's looking for a trustworthy doctor to perform some facial surgery. Can you do it? Do you know someone who can? Also, do you know anyone who's really a whiz with computers? That's interesting. Meat cake, pork and beans, cram and flour. Okay. Hey, Doc. I'm only sharing this with you because you seem like someone we can okay. trust. I was going to see if I could. Oh. Synthetic men they make up you, in the you can stop. Well, the rumors are true. Stop. I was trying to see if I could just drop that. Oh, no. We don't need to go in the basement. All right. So, yeah. I'm going to um, head back to Megaton and put stuff away. Go get as fixed up as I can get. And then in the next episode, we will figure out what's going to happen next. We still have to go do Moira's minefield, which is actually back up this way, but I'm kind of not really in the best of shape to be doing that, mostly because we're so damn encumbered. So with that being said, thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video. Plus 10 guns. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. See ya.